What's up everyone, Colby here with Colby's Cards. Today I'm back with another video. This time it is release day and it is Topps Update release day. So if you remember from last year, Topps Update in the green box was a super awesome product. Oh, <laughs> look at this, right on top. That's a Vlad Jr. Auto, numbered to 10. Holy sh snap. Oh my gosh. I mean, okay. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna leave that in the packaging. I'm not gonna take it out of there. So I was worried that we weren't gonna get our silver packs with that, but we do. Um, and then we get all 10 packs. Holy smokes. That's unbelievable. Well, right off the bat, Topps Update is treating me very well. <laughs> I'll certainly take it. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and keep ripping here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and start. I'm going to save the silver packs for a little bit, but uh, I'm just going to go ahead and start. So anyway, like I was saying, um, Topps Update from 2022 was really, really great. Uh, it was a really great product, and it does unfortunately look like some of these cards are a little dinged up at the bottom of the box at least their base cards, so it's not too, too bad. Uh, I'm gonna go not super fast, but you know, fast enough. Um, so we know what we're looking for pretty much. Uh, Matt Mervis is definitely one of the cards we're looking for, and uh, I don't think that one has any damage, so that's nice. Definitely a top rookie there in the class, followed by his rookie debut card, which is interesting. Uh, and then we keep going here. So we're looking for a lot of the rookie debuts that come out of here. Uh, here's a really cool card for me since I'm in Pittsburgh, big Pirates fan. Uh, here's the McCutcheon returning to Pittsburgh card, which is pretty sweet. Keep it rolling. So all of the good stuff is gonna be in the center of the packs, which is why it's nice to uh, nice to see that, you know, there's some protection around the cards. So here's our first parallel, looking good. Um, Sam Hilliard is a rainbow foil, and then this is going to be a gold card. And we've got, uh, Fernando Tatis and Manny Machado, so that's kind of cool. We also have a, we have a second gold card in the same pack. We've got a second gold card of Steven Strasburg. We've got an insert here, lots of stuff turned upside down. Luis Robert on the action stars. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then we've got a all-star game insert of Marcus Simeon. And Tristan McKenzie on the 88 design. And then we keep it rolling, and here's the rest of the base card. So overall, a pretty solid first pack. Um, albeit these were at the bottom of the box. Like I said, there's a couple dinged up, particularly this back card here. But it is Wandy Peralta, so I'm not too concerned. It's not even a rookie card. Uh, there's a nice Adley Rushman rookie debut card. And we keep it rolling here. Kyle Lewis in his Diamondbacks gear. And Colby Allard. So that's been one pack. And not to forget this card that was literally just right on top of the box. Numbered 7 of 10. Holy smokes. That, I, that blows my mind. You know what's actually really funny? Now that I piece this together, I guess you could say. Um, in my 2022 update box, I pulled a redemption of a Vlad Jr. All-Star Stitches autograph. And now this is 2023 update, and I pull an actual on-card Vlad Jr. autograph out of 10, which is just insane. Um, it does look like we've got our guaranteed auto out of here. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and set that down. I'm going to, I guess, set it here because I, I don't want to know who it is, to be honest with you. I think it's a Baseball Stars autograph. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and leave that there. Keep going through the base cards just because I like a little element of surprise, not even just for the video, but for myself. Um, so yeah, Cody Bellinger in his Cubs uniform. Garrett Stubbs, Matt McClain. Another, I think another decent rookie card. So I'm going to keep going through these packs <clears throat> since we know we've got our Baseball Stars auto in that stack over there. 
keep it rolling. We are guaranteed one autograph, which is obviously in that stack. And then we're also guaranteed um, uh, two relics on top of that. So one is probably going to be a manufactured relic. The other is probably going to be a regular jersey relic, probably one of those major league material cards or all-star cards or something like that. So looking out for those. All right, getting to the good stuff. This is probably a foil. So here's one of those gold foil cards, Michael Waka. Uh, we do, ooh, this is nice. These look really solid this year. Um, I'll be at a print line across the front, but we do get a Riley Green um, black gold insert. And then a George Kirby All-Star Game and a J-Rod Cup card on the 88 design. So pretty sick cards there. Whoops. Keep it rolling. There's Gunnar Henderson on the rookie debut. Chase DeYoung. I actually have his autograph on a baseball from Pirates Spring Training. And there's Drew Maggi, um, who was definitely a fan favorite. There's the Brett Beatty rookie debut. Fan favorite here in Pittsburgh just because he um, finally made it to the big leagues with the Pirates and then ended up getting his first major league hit, first major league appearance. Uh, he had been called up previously, but never had an at-bat. So it was pretty cool to see uh, in a Pirates uniform, again, since I'm a Pirates fan. So that was pretty awesome. Um, and yeah, here's a nice, speaking of the Pirates, Cody Bolton. And there's a really thick card in here. So that's probably going to be the manufactured relic, if I had to guess. So these, this box cost, what, $175. Um, but so far, I think we've already paid for the box with that box topper autograph. So that's obviously great. Uh, there's G-Man Choi. Now, I don't know, where did he go? I think he went to the Rangers, potentially. And then Grayson Rodriguez. So we have a, another foil. This one's a silver foil. Estevan Florial for the Yankees. And there's our relic. So it's going to be Thurman Munson on the MVP manufacturer relic. These are really thick. Um, it does have like an indent there in the back, which is fine. I don't necessarily care about this card too much, but still pretty cool. Probably honestly sell it to a Yankees fan. Uh, this is pretty nice. A Nolan Jones green foil out of $4.99. Nice rookie card there. True rookie, Nolan Jones green. Uh, I'll put that up here. We got the Aces, Nolan Ryan, and then a J.D. Martinez all-star game and a Jordan Walker 88. And then we'll go through the base. There's Spencer Turnbull. I hate that these are flipped every which way. Alec Burleson, PJ Higgins, Jose Hernandez, one of our pitchers in Pittsburgh. Vince Velasquez, another pitcher. All right, keeping it rolling here, another pack up. Still looking for one more relic, guaranteed relic. Who knows what else we're going to find, because this box has been insane. Here's our, I bet you this is going to be our relic right there. You can see that it is thicker card right in the center there. There's the Nolan Jones true rookie card. Some of these, I'm noticing like this one has a little indent on it. Some of the corners are a little messed up, which is unfortunate, but I mean... It's not, not all of them, which is good, but some of them do have some interesting uh, little nicks and stuff like that. So not great. All right, we're getting to the good stuff. Here is a Rob Ref Snyder. That's going to be one of our gold foil parallels for the Red Sox. Here's another gold, and this is going to be a Kanan Smith and Jigba true rookie gold. So that's pretty sick, especially me being a Pirates fan. That's pretty big. I mean, it's not the biggest name, but still a really cool card. And then we do have a Aces. All right, we got a bunch of stuff coming up here. Here's an Ezekiel Tovar Major League Material Relic. So this one's, I believe, not going to be numbered. But as I drop it, um, really sick card, too. It's got the, the Jersey Relic in there, just a swatch, but it does have a pinstripe. So that's pretty cool. And it's a rookie, so we'll take it. Um, and then we've got this time-spanning tandems, and this is Roger Clemens and Garrett Cole, so two all-star 
or all-time uh, great pitchers there for the Yankees. One current, you know, and then one pastime. There's a Shohei Black Gold. This one seemingly has less, like, shine to it than the other one did, but maybe I'm just wrong. There's Jose Ramirez All-Star Game and a Greg Maddox 88. And the rest of our base cards here. Yuri Perez. So overall, definitely a really solid box. Um, truthfully, can't can't believe we got we got that on top. I, it was just sitting there on top. Um, that Vlad Jr. auto, man, that is so sick. I just keep looking at it. On card out of ten, out of ten. So now I don't know, I mean, I know he didn't have the best year, but he's certainly an all-star, like a like a top player, obviously. Um, so do I get it graded? I, I do send cards to PSA. I've got a friend that has a PSA account. Do I get it graded or do I keep it in the packaging and sell it? Like I said, it's out of 10. So I don't really know. I don't know what to do because like graded that would be sick i mean I'll, I'll obviously try to take a look at it and make sure that it's <clears throat> at least a decent condition card here is a pablo lopez gold foil set that over here there's a nice mike trout tops black gold vlad jr man of the hour we've got eduardo uh julian nice rookie card there in the 88 design and then back to the base cards There's another Gunnar Henderson debut. So you're going to see some uh, repeats in here. You're definitely, at least I would I would hope and assume, that you're going to get a complete set out of the uh, out of a jumbo box like this. So there are usually 330 cards in a complete set. I would assume that is the same here for Tops Update. I'm actually going to go ahead and open one of our silver packs. Let's get this out of the way. Just go ahead with this one here on top. Um, one thing I'm excited about, so my main PC player, and we do have something of color in here. We've got an orange. I don't know what that's going to be out of. I will say this is just a advertisement thing. Uh, so we've got Brewer Hicklin. We've got Dustin Pedroia, Zach Neto, and orange for the Phillies. JT Real Muto. So that one is 11 of 25. Look at this box. Holy smokes. I don't even know where to put this stuff. Um, so silver pack. The cards look great. Uh, there's no scratches that I can see up front. Um, two, two out of the four cards were rookies and one was out of 25. I mean, hard to beat. Hard to beat. We still got four packs left. Uh, we did uncover both our relics, and then we know that our autograph's gonna be in here. So I'm just gonna keep rolling. I think my thought before that I didn't finish was that uh, I'm pretty excited because Starling Marte, uh, my main PC player who agree with it or not, but that's my guy, um, does have a 88 design silver card, silver pack autograph. Um, so I'm excited to potentially get that if I don't obviously hit it in this box, which I probably am not going to. Um, I'll probably go and pick it up on eBay or something, but here's a nice rain, uh, ra yeah, rainbow foil, sorry, of Michael Harris II, rookie debut. So that's a really nice card to get. I guess we're putting that up on the stage because that's pretty sick. Here's a gold card of Enbundo Sosa, and there were some fuzzies coming out of there, like the little cardboard fuzzies uh but here's a gold Edmundo Sosa out of 2023 Warren Spann followed by Mookie Betts all-star game and a James Outman 88 design rookie card so again these uh these packs are solid really really solid and we've seen this collation before with Drew Maggi and Chase DeYoung like I said before um for the Pirates and then we've seen Anthony Volpe I don't think I mentioned it but we did see that one so just going a little bit quicker here since we do see some duplicates in this pack. Josh Young rookie debut. 
All right, we got three packs left, plus one more silver pack. And honestly, I think this has got to be already potentially the best box of baseball cards I've ever opened. Um, I, I mean, I so in terms of flagship, it definitely there's Jordan Walker, Mark Melanson still pitching. Um, Eduardo Julian gets a nice rookie card there. There's his base. But yeah, I mean, this is something else. I mean, this is insane. How many hits are coming out of here? I mean, I know this stuff is like short printed. I know, I mean, it's release day. Not that that should have anything to do with it, but who knows if they like top load the product and then, you know, put it out into the wild. There's a nice uh, Thaddeus Ward silver foil rookie. And then a Kodai Singa. This is going to be a rookie debut gold card. So that's sick as well. Um, Grayson Rodriguez, even, on the Aces insert. Sonny Gray on the All-Star game and an 88 of Jared Schuster. So coming out guns blazing with the rookies here. Obviously, update's not going to have, um, you know, I, I don't know. I mean, it, it's full of rookies, obviously. There's Yoshida. So it's just a really sick product. Uh, like I was trying to say before, I mean, this is probably the best flagship box that I've personally ever opened, which I think is incredible. Um, and I've opened some nice, some nice stuff too. Um, I mean, I, what, I, I don't know what else I could ask for, truthfully. Um, so I'm just going to keep it rolling. We've got two base packs left. Again, 10 packs in a jumbo box, 46 cards per pack. Um, yeah, I, I just, um, there's the Kanan Smith and Jigbo rookie. Um, his brother actually, I believe it is, or was drafted into the NFL, or at least as a top prospect um, from Ohio State, uh, or the Ohio State, for those of you that go there, went there. Um, but yeah, I know there's that's kind of cool, Colin Holderman and Yeri De Los Santos. Um, I don't even know what I'm saying, because all of these cards are sick. These are so sick. Um, William Contreras, here is a veteran combos of... Ale Slugger, so Mike Trout and Matt Chapman, that's pretty cool. Gold foil card. And then, oh my god, we've got out of 72? We got a black, oh my goodness, we have a black. It's not the best name, but it's Trevor Williams. Um, but it's black and numbered out of 72. This, I mean, this, this is insane. This is absolutely insane. Uh, we've got a time-spanning tandems, David Ortiz and Rafi Devers. Okay. Um... And then a rookie of Corbin Carroll, all-star game rookie. That's pretty cool. And my guy, another one of my guys, Andrew McCutcheon on the 88. So I, honestly, I would have been happy with just that pack. Now, granted, it wasn't, you know, the black out of 72 wasn't, uh, wasn't the hugest name. But I mean, come on. What, black out of 72. I'll, I'll probably try to edit this and put all of the, uh, all of the odds with what I pull and then at the end I like to always like put together there's Jason Delay rookie card uh put together like multiply all of the odds um just to see what are the chances of all of those coming in one box which is pretty crazy um just to see that you know written down and it's like one in like a million so boxes would have all of these in there um I just think it's really cool uh so I'm gonna keep going here Don Smith let's move these inserts out of the way those up there. All right, Dom Smith. This is the last base pack, um, which honestly, I might have to go pick, another, pick up another box of this stuff because this is insane. Uh, Kodai Singa, there's the rookie debut. I don't know, did I see the Corbin Carroll rookie debut? I might have been talking, but now that I <laughs> speak it into existence, talk about that. Corbin Carroll rookie debut right there. Christian Pache plays for the Phillies now. Had no idea. Um, Bryce Terang, rookie debut. There's that Trevor Williams, Emmanuel Valdez, Mason Miller. So we've got rookie combo. Ooh, we have something else numbered. So we've got a rookie combos, gold foil. I'm going to put that up here because, of course. Uh, actually, no, I'm not. Uh, we've got an out of 299. Wow, that's sharp. Wow, look at that. The black, gold, black. Oscar Colas. Black parallel. 280 of 299. 
Man, this stuff is insane. Oh my goodness. And then we get a Jordan Walker and a Nolan Arenado, time spanning tandem. We've got Randy Rosarena, All Star game, and a Kodai Senga rookie 88. And then more base. I mean, this, this is the single handed best best baseball box I've ever opened. I, 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 I'm speechless. We still have an auto and a silver pack. I mean, this is ridiculous. At this point, why not give me a printing plate? I mean, that's getting greedy, but okay. So let's move these out of the way. We already looked at those. Um, I think I'm gonna do the silver pack and then the auto because I'm nervous for the auto. I don't want it to be a nobody, but we'll see. We'll see how this goes. All right, so I've got silver pack here. I doubt that we're gonna have anything in here because of the last one having a orange of 25, which is just insane. We do get a Derek Cheater and a Mike Trout. Um, let's see. Taj Bradley, rookie card. And a Matt McLean. look at that. So, I mean, obviously they're not autographed or numbered or anything, but those are some pretty sick cards. I mean, it's just, this is unreal. So, let's go ahead and see what's in here. Here's the top half of the pack first. There's Gabriel Moreno, rookie. Tristan Casas, Riley Green debut. Brooks Raley, I have his autograph on a baseball, I think. Michael Harris debut. Benintendi, Dylan Moore. Um, Ding, Domingo Herman. Keep it going. All right, so we're down to the last set of insert cards. Um, we've got a Cooper, Cooper Hummel on the rainbow foil. We've got whoa, Orlando Arce out of 499, who's making news because he's trash talking the fills. Um, Ken Griffey Jr. on the 88, as well as Sean Murphy on the All Star game. So, got something else back here. Nice, Jordan Walker, Action Stars. Uh, so, Orlando Arce is going to be, I don't know what color. We do have an autograph for the Dodgers. James Altman, rookie auto. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. I mean, this has been potentially the best box of baseball. I've already said it. The best box of baseball cards I've ever opened in my life. Unbelievable. Un-freaking believable. And then to boot, a bonus auto. We got two autos. Got an out of 25. We got gold rookies, gold rookie debuts. We got uh, out, of, out of black out of 72. We got a James. I mean, this is absurd. Absolutely ridiculous. So, I, I don't know what else to say. Um, this has been the most insane box of baseball cards I've ever opened in my entire life. And uh, thanks for watching. <laughs> I guess that's all I've got for you. So, thanks for watching, everybody. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye, everyone.